Hi, this is Daniel Nugent, painter and decorator. Today I just want to show you what rollers I use. Um, as again, this is personal choice. Probably a lot of people would disagree, but it's what I use and what kind of like my go-tos now. So we start with the ceilings. So with ceilings, as you can see here, this is a 14 inch cage, um, quick release cage. You've got the Arrow Worthy Barracuda there. And you've got the Worcester as well. This is, um, I would say, I prefer this over the uh, Arrowworthy. So this is the Sherlock. Um, and as you see, it's got a little pin there. But the beauty of the both of these is it's got the pin as well. So you can use both of these with this pole, which has this little mechanism here. Just push that, push that back, put the roller on let it go and that that little bit there goes into the pin um so this is the worcester sherlock extension pole you can get three different sizes solid great piece piece of kit um yeah fantastic so that's like that's the pole i use three different sizes of that as well i've got um so 14 inch for the ceilings so onto the sleeves we've got worcester microfiber or the arrow worthy microfiber 14 inch um so nine sixteenths of a nap which is like kind of like i would say it's like the, the long pole version or you've got the three eighths which is a medium uh probably use these on like large areas of walls but i'll always use like the bit, bit of a longer pole for my ceilings um just makes life that bit easier so that's ceilings um going on to your walls like your nine inch again i love worcester i just think they're just solid, great pieces of kit. Um, you get all this on my paintbrush. Um, Arrowworthy, you can get in stores now. Quite quite a few stores do Arrowworthy. Again, with the pin. Um, works with the Sherlock. So, again, um, we've got Arrowworthy here, nine inches. Um, similar. I've got like Worcester nine inches as well. Both in like nine sixteenths and three eighths. All microfiber again. I tend to like using the medium pole um, for walls. So, um, yeah, I, I generally use more of the, the, the sort of medium, you know, this one here. Um, but both good good roller sleeves, you know, fantastic. Both fit on the, the cages, you know. You can, like, change them about a bit. So that's that. Now, sm what, smaller jobs, so say, like, bathrooms and, like, you've got a little bathroom or round kitchen units i use this it's like the jumbo coater this is like yeah it's sure grip it's worcester again fantastic got the pin so you can click it onto your pole um quick release very easy to use but i use these these are like probably yeah six and a half inches long so they're quite long as you can see longer than usual so I use these on a lot of uh, smaller jobs. Just makes life so much easier rather than getting a big nine inch kit out. There's no point. So I use this quite a lot. Um, prefer, again, the Worcester. Can use it in both. Um, just my preference. I just find it a bit better made. But what I would suggest is for your normal rad rollers, so your normal frame like this, you can't beat this. This is the Barracuda. This is by Arrowworthy. Okay and it's got the pin in again so click straight into the pole doesn't come off doesn't move quick release fantastic i love it that's all interchangeable absolutely love it love using these um so look even with these you can get arrow worthy classic microfiber rollers these are long poles you can get sh short pole medium pole um again in the 6.5 this is a slightly cheaper range still good though um and yeah it for me you know click on there away you go and you can also get these in bumper packs as well so we've got the short pile medium pile long pile it's you know, all microfiber and that's what i always use always use microfiber for water base and solvent in both so uh so far we've got all that 
Um, and then onto these. So these are the fussy blokes, which I absolutely love. So again, short, medium, long. So the short pile are the red tips, medium are the green. I'll just took one out, I'll show you. I use probably these the most. Um, so yeah, you've got, each one's got a tip on the end. So that's, that, that'll be red. This is green. That's like an orange color. So generally for, um, I'd say like walls maybe, or, or sort of rough, real rough woodwork. If you want an undercoat, use these an undercoat. These are a good all rounder. Them for a real fine surface finish. So if you're doing like MDF and stuff or built in covers, brilliant, really nice finish with them. So, uh, or window seals, you know, so yeah, fussy blokes, fantastic. And they fit onto this frame here, which fits onto this pole here. Just makes your life so much easier. So happy days. That's what, that's what I use. Um, as a, again, as I say, everyone's different, but personal preference. This is all my go-tos. So thanks for watching and uh, please subscribe. Thank you.